the nice looking sky. Oh, this the sun looks so beautiful. Like like other things that you best of. But I kind of want to use this as things. My hand here, but I don't know how. Well, today you're going to know how. Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Today, um, 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 I'm doing redstone. I'm doing redstone. I'm doing redstone. Yeah, I am. Well, um, I'm not too good at redstone, but I decided to do this because I haven't posted. The whole week and I'm sorry and yeah I'm really sorry for that I don't know what was going on but um anyways uh, I just heard a door in my room here open probably my cat if I, don't, I have a cat um in my room so I'm in my office well but today I'm going to do how to do rest the first thing you have to learn is um, first how Vestum works. Then I'll teach you what Vestum can do, and then some other Vestum things that actually is not used rest most. You can, but um, the first thing you need to know. Uh, first, I'm going to 15 blocks. This is one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. Now, I'm going to place a block right here where one more rest on dust. Now, that dust won't turn on because if I come over here, see the particles? Um, this part here is on, but this one doesn't have any of those particles or the lighter on. It's just black red. That means that's off. So if I put, this is a lot of the Western things you can do it. But if I put a Western lamp here, it's not on. But if I change it to here, it's on because it's receiving power from this one. You can do it on here. Oh. And you can do it there, this side, but it won't get power because the redstone has to go pointing into it. But if I do this, Place my up and do that, it's powered. So, yeah, to let you know. But the 15 block light is a positive, but to make it a thousand block light, you need to make one of these. Let's do repeaters. Now, if I come over here and place one right here and move this lamp back. There. If I place a restroom peter right here, because as you can see, it's not on. But if I make it right here, it's on. Restroom repeaters does make a one tick delay. So, or a couple. Like if I come back here, after I set this switch, it would be one. One. See? But if I don't, it'll just go ding, like boom, boom, boom. But it has one uh, delay on here. And that's useful because you can make like time, timers for it. Uh, and you can, uh, it's not one, you can make it to be four. And that's useful because then you don't need to have four repeaters. And it does help to this now yeah next thing I want to teach you is actually going to be about repeaters again these things right here 
if I come back over here, we'll teach you how to make a, a simple little clock. Now, you need this. Now, before I go into that, I want to teach you one more thing. Now, if I go like that, one, two, one, two, you know, you should know, this one can't go upwards. Actually, it can. By this redstone torch here, this thing. Now, it does give out light, but it only one. That's six, oh, six out of, uh, six out of, um, one out of seven light uh, out of a torch. And a normal torch is a light level seven. Uh, but anyways, if I press this here, redstone torches are always on. But if you give it a redstone sinker or the level, or a button actually, it turns off. So that's useful to go up, up, and see torches can power blocks above, and if and the wooden part of the torch is getting power, so this one's turned off, and then that's not giving in power to this one, and this uh, wood part is not giving in power, so the torch stays on. So now that means you can make a little redstone thing go out of that. And also, that's useful. Now, that. Now, if I put a switch, the restore is off. But there's one problem to this. You can actually make repeaters out of this. This is like when Western torches was a way to make repeaters back in the day when these things, these. Little things did not come out. So yeah. But and while I'm here I'm gonna tell you something else about repeaters. Uh, so that's how the torch works. So before when don't, uh, the repeaters didn't come out, uh, they used to use this for a repeater. was a repeater before. That was an old repeater. It uses five block, a uh, four, um, yeah, four block space, no, one, yeah, four block space around it, but that's how people made it before. These little things come out, but there was one more problem with these things. But now, these things are not two way. Uh, see, I put a repeater there, it doesn't work. Because, see this little arrow there? My little cursor? Yeah, that's the arrow that will come through. But since the rest of is coming through here, the arrow is trying to pull it back. Uh, towards it so it doesn't work. So I'll just let you know there. But anyway, now you know about torches and um, repeaters. Now this is how clocks are, are, be are, are made sometimes by this. That's a clock. Now I'm just going to turn this first um, off because it's laggy. Um, this is a clock and um, it ticks every like, uh, looks like two seconds or three, but you can make that longer. This is the longest time in. And this is, a, that's, this is a nine tick. So every nine restroom ticks or game ticks, um, this thing goes. So this can be useful for dispensers. 
I'll teach you about later. But this is a clock that people use to make. And you can make it longer if you just do simply this. This you can make it almost as long time. I believe it can only go up to five each side. Because I tried that before even longer and it did not work. But if you do place one there, you can make it go up. Oh, uh, was two, really? No, that won't work actually. Yeah. But this is a clock. Now, um, there's another kind of clock that you can make. I'll be able to write around here. It's actually super simple. I need is like this mouse space. Now you need a torch here and a redstone gas here. That's a clock. But the problem is um, the rest in like the new new version of the game before torches did not burn out but now they do. So there's a little problem with that, but you can just kick start it again by this. Yeah, there. Um, so that's kind of another clock and you can always stop this clock by just doing that or doing this. I usually like doing this. Yeah, just like that. That's how you stop it. So now you know about restored repeaters and torches. Uh, kind of. I'm going to go back in the torchy way. And I will show you setting the out. Now, I'll make this long little path here. Mm. Oh, that's actually a pretty good way to do it. Don't do that on that though. though. Now, if I do that, I just place the level down. Um, Western torches is kind of a cool way where they power the block above and to the side. But if a torch is like that, it powers it by this so like it's still power you even, even though this thing is off so it's uh, another way to do it just place a uh, thing there and uh you're still not good but the door still doesn't power it the good way to do it is by doing like this and now it will work because it's it can't power the block below it. So see it turned off. Okay now. And um another thing you can do, uh, instead of just using levels, you can use buttons, pressure plates, or these kind of pressure plates. This you need lighter stuff. And this you need heavier stuff, like more stuff. Now you can power things by this. Now, press plate, you power. Stone press plate, you power. Now, stone buttons um, is like a free second pass, I believe. And wooden buttons is like four or five yeah so you can see there now I'm just going to get this stuff out of my inventory oh and another way you can do it is trip wire hooks trip wire hooks these things are complicated now if I set one up here you need swing to do this by placing it like that I'm going to need one there and there. Now it's set. 
As you can see, if you look to the side now, it's powered when I go through. Because uh, this trip wire is like you trip and you get them stuck and the rest of the comes out. So that's another way you can do it. And you can hook up the rest of to this one too. And it will power on too. Now, that's all the ways you can power redstone. No, kind of. There are some other ways and other cool things you can do with. Oh, actually, this thing is another crazy way. This is how you could store your redstone, and it's for redstone, so it powers it. Now, redstone blocks power redstone. The best way to do these are with sticky pistons that I will get into right now. So if I come over here and make just a cool little set here, put rest on there. Now you need rest on going into the block doing this. Now pistons. Pistons are a cool thing that came out and these used to be in a mod. But now you can just do this. Well, you can set up something like this. Well, oh, I need a lever. And now it will power the uh, this part that extends it, that pushes whatever block is in front of it. And you can do a cool thing doing this. Now, if I, I'm going to set it up here. So, as you can see, I can do, oh, why is that not going? I don't get why that's not going. Oh, I know why. On this, you need to lay, because if, those, if this piston is there, you can't push a block into there, because there's here. So you need a little delay. Now if I plus see as you can see it's going back and forth. The easiest way to do it is with a button, but you can do this with it. So I'm gonna make the same setup as before exact same setup Now, here's another thing you can do with a uh, redstone. If you place a block here, a uh, redstone just there, it will connect. So the easiest way is to just go like that. So you can make it super complex and super um, compact. But um, but the other problem um, thing is slabs do not block redstone cords. So yeah. It goes through, but if you place two on top of each other, it does. So remember that. Now here, I'm going to set up this cool, uh, a clock. I'm going to set up. So, uh, this is the same clock that we did before, but um, if I place the rest on here, and slower, 
to make this go faster. This. Need to work on a couple times. That is totally complete. Stop it. Why is that not going? Stood. Yeah, <laughs> you can do some crazy things with that, but I, I can't do it right now. So those are normal pistons. Another simple way by doing that is doing this. So now we're on sticky pistons. You craft these by putting a normal piston by with a slime bar. So yeah, that's how you craft them. But sticky pistons sticks to blocks. So if I do this here, I can make this go by doing that. And so if on, and I can make a cool little thing here. Oh, and um, repeaters won't connect to redstone there. It has to be coming into there, let you know. So if I place something there, it won't uh, do anything. Oh, and that does that too. So I can make this cool little thing here using both of my little traptions. And by turning this on, turn that off, oh, and then turning this, oh, I jammed, I jammed it, yeah, I need to do this, no one saw a thing, I wasn't doing a big problem but um you can do like a cool redstone thing like this and you don't have to hook up the redstone to turn this off and on you can just do something very simple like this that it just totally stops the thing so i can just so yeah so you can do some crazy things with Vesta. Oh, now I just jammed that. Oh, great. Yeah, so you can do a couple of crazy things with pistons. But the, yeah, they're a little complicated. Now I'm just going to break this whole system up by doing this, doing that, turning that off, and there we go. So you can do some things with pistons. Now to some other things. Uh, I won't actually show you this, but you can activate iron doors, wooden doors, button lamps, fence gates, trap doors, droppers, dispensers, nut and box, and TNT with this. But um, that's what you can activate it with. Um, but now, I'm going to show you something very cool. Now, in, in the 1.5, uh, I think, um, update, they added uh, the daylight sensor, the compare 
the weight and press plates heavy and light and uh maybe hoppers um and that's most uh it was a redstone update oh and they added the block of redstone but the daylight is super simple cool because you can do something very cool like this so a daylight center is not a full block but if you put redstone beside it you can see it's turning on now watch the redstone see the redstone is on watch it when i turn it to night boom it only has two so this makes it super helpful uh, when um, you're trying to always make it day or if it's daytime make this awesome tune I know someone did that but you could do something like this now if it's nighttime you can go now I need a torch for this I actually need to make this one more bigger can do that and then that and now I'm going to show you something crazy awesome now these all this is stuff that you can do with redstone and you can use other blocks to work with redstone but there's one thing that you can't actually get unless you have cheats now it's the great and mr command block how, and i'm going to show you how to get it it's give your player name mine is lana god the minecraft or id 137 um, for command block here command block now you're going to get this awesome little looking block that looks like this now if you have a text back it won't look like this but yeah it'll be this now and it will say in the chat it will do that unless you don't have your chat on but you need to to do it oh actually you can change it uh commands only but um if it's night time like right now you can put in command times that get now i need to um they like reset this uh, so the simplest way is to go like that and then boom now if I change it quickly to night time boom day in one second so um because uh, in daytime you have like a 15 pause in the middle of the day but in night time you only have two so add one more to that and if that's not on it won't power this block that will not power this so the torch will be on it comes to here and it will do this but it won't because it's already on and they already used it so all this is if it's daytime this will go on to like 15 power this block that powers this torch that turns it off that turns this one off that will set the trap but then it, when it's night time these two will be powered but not this one so the block won't be powered so this it will be on that turns this one on and it will activate this command block that times it's day and then it this goes down back to free that turns off that torch that sets it again now you um the daylight sensor you can't like hide it like this you can't go like this because that the, um it needs light to do it now that uh, this no I, I don't think good idea no not a good idea it won't work it, it, it won't work 
Just telling you. Actually, it might because it's just if any if it doesn't have daylight, it won't work. So it's better off just putting it in a cave, opening or something. But this does have to be um a chunk uh, loaded to activate. So yeah, but that's a cool little thing, and um you can use like any command in this block that would be in the chat so like this all these commands every single one you can use in command block to do stuff and that's all of it that's every single one you can use so um but that's going to end it off here hope hope you learned a couple things about redstone today and um actually i i kind of feel like I want to do another one so then next episode we're going to teach you all about redstone comparators with the awesome hopper to go with the dispenser and dropper and then I will kind of teach you about these and these special plates because they have a couple more things that you don't, you might not know. So, and then the last next episode after that, we're going to teach uh, about power rails, detector rails. Then we're going to use rails and activate rails with all these minecart uh, things. And then the next, uh, then after that, we're going to um, look at setting some things that other people made. So um, if you, if Redstone is too complicated for you, go watch Selfly, go watch Etho, or watch me if you just want to have a quick little talk and just see a couple things in one episode. But after, after I do that, I'll probably teach you some more about another thing called gates, um, flip flops, tees, uh, and a crazy amount of other things. But um, for now, I'll see you all next time. And I'll and um, hope you enjoyed and hit that subscribe button. But before I go, um. Can you uh, tell me if this works? Um, I fixed this awesome my uh, picture, so uh, I'm just going to do this. Hit us. So I hope it's in the wheel um, where the F3 is, uh, the top left, uh, the top left corner. It is going to be in. So uh, if it is. So uh, good, if it's not, oh I need to fix with some other things up. Did I just make that full block jump? I actually made that full block jump. One, two, three, four. How did I make that jump? Oh, yeah, actually I made a full block jump. I'm getting really good at parkour. Ah, maybe not. Ah, not on the edge of the block, that's why. Oh, no, I have my dog. But I'll see you on next time, YouTubers. Bye!